Thank you. Thank you very much. And welcome back to this channel. And I know you are busy uh, writing and preparing your, for your final examinations, the test one, test two, and also the examinations. And then today we are uh, pledging with you. We are asking you to listen to this video up until to the end and to refer back to the previous modules that have been recorded. And then I welcome you back. Today we are going to look and to anticipate in building structural surveying. That is what we'll be looking at under L4. And then under this module, uh, we have uh, entailed about the compass survey. Remember that the compass survey is very important tool in ensuring that the bearings in terms of the angles, they are at a similar place and then they are at a straight angle. So remember that uh, we must understand now the concept or the definition of the compass survey. The key concept is bearings, which they are referred to magnetic north direction. And then you are here on survey. Uh, so what are the principles in the examination? You'll be asked to say, list now the principles or discuss the principles of compass survey. So one of the principles is a uh, transversing. Transversing, it is one of the key elements of this survey. And then we are saying that a connected survey lines discussed a with a chain and the directions are measured with an angle measuring the instrument. One of the transverse method, the angles are measured with a compass. Hence, the method is called the compass transversing. You get your two mark question. Very straightforward and a very simple. A hit the subscription button. Okay. And then uh, if we are moving on again, we are to see that we discuss now the magnetic compasses. And what are these? Uh, we are saying there are two main types of the magnetic uh, compasses, compass, which is one of this severe compass, and the prismatic compass. So there are two types of these compasses. Then you get your two marks, larger and more accurate instrument. And it is mostly used in a stand or the tripod. The prismatic compass is written is often a small instrument which is handheld for observing this employed in less accurate work. So we are to see that uh, this uh, service compass, it is playing much role in terms of the accuracy. And then they can say differentiate between instrument compasses. So you need to understand that concept uh, very well. If we are moving on, we are to see that uh, here we talk about the systems that are used to express the bearings. So to express it is to system number one, we have the whole circle bearing, which can be expressed as the WCB. This uh, is the bearing of a line measured in the clockwise direction. So clockwise direction from this uh, particular direction. So they move clockwise uh, of the true north in the lines and they vary from zero to 360. Number two, we talk of the quadrantal bearing, which can be expressed now in the QB. In this system, the bearing of a line is measured eastward or westward from the north of the south, whichever is nearer. The direction can be either clockwise or anti-clockwise, depending upon on the position now of line. We will see that when we are making now a practicals. Okay. And then we talk of the magnetic bearing and true bearing. So here you need to differentiate between the two. And then when we are doing the calculation, we are going to express ourselves in terms of those. And then we are talking of the magnetic bearing. So we are saying that uh, the magnetic bearing of a line uh, is bearing of a line. It is measured from the magnetic north. It can be given as the WCB measured from true north or the QB. But when calculating the, uh, to, uh, the true bearing, the QB now must be converted to the WCB. So uh, we know uh, those calculate the WCB I have, uh, is the whole circle of bearing. All right. And then uh, if ever we are moving on, we talk of the two bearing of a line is horizontal angle between the north and the south uh, survey line. It is measured from the true north in N anti-clockwise direction, it can be given uh, as a whole CB or the QB in this instant, all right? And then I hope you are getting these concepts uh, right, and I hope that uh, you are 
to ask you thank you very much for tuning on ensure that you are hitting the subscription button and ensure that you are sharing to those who are concerned at matriculas needed specialist thank you very much for your time